Jiro. I'm very proud. Oh, I miss you so much. Oh, I miss you too. Welcome home. Thank you. It's hey. good to be home. Yeah, sure. <laughs> How are you? Oh, thank you. Lisa, you didn't see me, right? Ah, oh, actually, I didn't see you. I only saw my beautiful mama. Look at this girl. <laughs> <Okay>. Troublemaker. Oh, <laughs> so, so, so. <laughs> what of Zendaya? Is she not back from work yet? Oh, no, mama. But just come, let me. I can entertain you. I have so many gist for you. Really? Mm. Yes, something <laughs> happened three days ago on our street. There was this girl, she was just looking at me, looking at me, looking at me, and guess what? She fell! <laughs> <laughs> and there's so much to the story that you can ever imagine. Can come you? in, come in. I just, I was Lisa! Kill me, I'm telling you! So that was it though. So what did you tell him? I only said I wasn't interested. Tell me, what was the problem? Is it that you don't like him or what? No, I like him more. I only wanted him to chase after me for a couple of months, you know. But the next thing I knew, he was running after my friend. And now they're dating. <laughs> my dear, men of these days have no luxury of time chasing after women. I tell you, they don't have that time anymore. But I can recall you told me daddy chased after you for a couple of months and then finally married you. That was then. A lot has changed now. Especially now that we have social media system everywhere now. I'm telling you. <laughs> He's lost, not mine. Ah. Lily, you can't kill me, I'm telling you. <laughs> Oh, my princess! My princess! Mama! Oh, you're here! <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> How was your trip down here? Ah, very peaceful. Nice. And thank God. Nice. <laughs> How are you, baby girl? Welcome. Welcome. How thank was work, my darling? Work was stressful as usual. Please sit. <sighs> but thank God I survived. <laughs> Have you given Mama something to eat? This one? Oh, yes, I did. She has been feeding me with just oh. a lot of it. You fed her stories. <laughs> Mama, but I gave you biscuits. I just finished it though. Did you also give her bubble gum? Uh, no, I'll give her sweets. Lollipop. Sweets. My Lisa. daughter, my princess, is back <laughs> to feed me yes. with my delicious meal. That's what right. Ah, you know now, she's a professional when it comes to vegetable soup. I make that better, you know. What are you doing? Don't you pray before you eat? I prayed in my mind. And you're eating already. Let us pray. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for today. Thank you for this meal. We thank you for Johnny Mercies. We thank you for this wonderful meal presented to us this <coughs> evening. We pray, O oh Lord, that you bless as we eat we eat to our nourishment of body and soul. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Ah, Lily. How are you? I'm fine. How was it night? I'm fine, thank you. I'm um, sorry, Ma. I wanted to let you know that there's food in the kitchen in case you're hungry. My sister made food for you. You mean my daughter-in-law prepared breakfast? I still left for work early. That's her normal routine. Like, she does that for a living. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Mm. This girl must be a champion. Ma. That's how my queen spoils her cute king. Hey, oh. 
Please, no one should disturb that care for me. Ah. I beg of you. Mom. Because oh, my daughter-in-law is special to me. Ah, Mama. Which one is your daughter-in-law? I am your biological son, don't forget. I know you are my son, but she's my she's important to me. Please, you should not be bothering her. I am your blood, though. We go back. Be more concerned about me, Mama. Huh? At least be happy. Your daughter-in-law is taking good care of your kids. Huh? My son, I can see that your electronics business has picked up real good. Exactly, ma'am. And all thanks to my lovely wife, Zen. Do you know she actually took some loan for me from her bank? Wow. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh, that girl is an angel. She's more than an angel, ma'am. Hey. She is explicitly Wonderful. Hey. Sometimes I feel like I don't deserve her. Well, you know what you have to do? You have to always be by her side. Mm. Yes, sure. Because ladies like Zendaya are rare to find. Please, I know. don't treat her bad. Never. Pick up on one. Mm -hmm. I want. Hey. I want. She means the whole world to me. I promise. Thank you. Are you serious? So he hasn't called you since then? Call me what for? I don't understand. That guy is in the past, and that's where he's going to remain. Lisa. 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 Oh, I will see you again. Um, bro, how about that stuff I asked you for? What could that be? Oh, I almost forgot. The new hair. Yes. I will give you the money when I return from the shop. Uh, bro, now, you can give me the money now. I don't have money on me. Eh, well, you do transfer. You transfer, you have your phone here now. Lisa, I will transfer the money as soon as I get to the shop. I promise. I don't have money on me. I promise. First thing first. I will transfer the money as soon as I step into the shop. Okay? Are you sure? I cross my heart. All right. Promise me. I promise. <laughs> can I go now? Yeah, sure, we can. Oh, thank <laughs> All right then. Bye bye, sir. All right. Bye bye, sir. Mm -hmm. Hello, honey. You say what? Your car? Okay, 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 it's okay. I was about driving out. In that case, I'll have to come to your office. I'll drop my car and then take yours to the mechanic. It's okay, my love. You'll see me soon, okay? All right. Michael! Yes, sir. Why is my car not washed? I'm sorry, sir. So, something inside. Please shut your mouth up. You're sorry. Every time you're sorry. Go open the gates for me.
close that your eye would be like bat on. Close them. He's not your type. <laughs> they use man to you. Ah ah. Well, I thought I was made from a man's rib. Not my brother-in-law's rib. You can see that he has found his missing rib, and it's definitely not from you. Rubbish. <laughs> Every time. Ah. They cost you. You know, I find it hard to believe that only one woman owns this wonderful creation. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. He is owned by a legion of women. So you are trying to tell me that he eats from just one pot. He doesn't eat outside. No, he doesn't. I beg rest. How would you know? See, Angela, I will not blame you if you don't believe me. It's not your fault. At least from the stories you read online, the stories you've told me, how they play you. My brother-in-law is different. You see that man? God washed his hands very well to create him specially for my sister. And I can tell you that I have never seen or experienced any love close to that. He loves my sister so much. Don't even go there. <laughs> Don't go there. Do you talk sometimes and as in I am disappointed? Mm. Love is not enough. A man can love you, buy you heaven and earth, and still cheat on you because it's in their DNA. Not my brother-in-law. I can vouch with my life. You can vouch? Yes, I can. I can vouch with my life. Not him. Don't that will fire you. Why? You say you can vouch for a man. A man. You don't have sense. You don't have sense. Men are like that. They can't help it. Enough. Enough, please. Let's forget about my big brother's talk. Hmm? Let's focus on something else. Okay. Anyway, I love the way you guys relate. You know, if I was not this close to you, I would think you all are siblings. That man is a very wicked man. Anytime you go to his place, he will be giving you attitude, you know? Acting boss, boss. Really? Seriously? Well, I'm sorry, you, my dear. I will not really blame the man because you are saying that you're a loose girl, like you're a loose like rapper, and he's trying to hold himself. So something doesn't really know. Are you okay? I'm okay. I'm are just you are you sure you're I'm just... Go get dressed. Okay. Where are these children? We are running late for church. Happy Mother's Day, Mama. Oh, thank you, dear. Ah, what's the matter? You're not looking bright. Come and sit. Come. Sit in. What is it? Nothing. You can talk to me. Talk to me. She misses our parents. That's what it is. Uh oh. I'm ready. Oh. Okay, my babies. Come and sit down here. Okay. Come on, sit. Okay. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, my love. I know how a day like this makes you feel. But I want you to know that I will always be there for you. Oh. Okay? <laughs> I am not trying to steal the love of your parents from your heart. No, not at all. But I wish to give you all the love a mother can give to her children. Okay? You are so sweet. Thank you so much. You know, since I married your son, you have treated my sister and I as if we are yours. Thank you. And for that, we're thankful. But I'm yours. And you are mine. <laughs> we are family. Yes, we are. Aren't we? We are family. Yeah, we are. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's not get tearing up now. Hmm? We're going to church. We don't need to ruin our makeup. Right. So we we'll get to church. We get right. going. Right. Where is this boy now? Feel! 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 Yes, mom. Here I am. Why do I feel you always ganging up against me? Hmm? To the canal, please. Come right. on, let's go. We're waiting for you. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> let's go. Justice for you. Justice for you. What are you doing? Mom, you should be in front. How many times am I going to tell you this? You are a queen. And the place of a queen is where? Beside her king. Move over. I keep telling her this. I have always told her that. Are you shut up? You've always told her what? almost 2 a.m. and you are awake. What is the matter? Nothing. Something is definitely bothering you. What is it? your mom. What about my mom? She has been so good to me. The least I can do for her is to give her a grandchild. 
definitely you will give her. It's been three years. Three whole years, Phil. My love. Mom is not complaining. I am not either. We talked about not to worry and leave it for God. He gives children at his own time. Okay. Listen. You need to go back to sleep. You know you need to wake up early for work. Please. Come on. Who else is traveling? Oh, she's having a talk with her department. Ah, she has a flight to catch. That woman's discussion does not end. Oh, how about I go in there and tell her what she just said? You wouldn't dare, because if you do, no more ice cream for you. <laughs> And you know blackmail in Nigeria is a sin. It's a crime. And they say gossip is bad. Look at you. Let me just pity you. It's not like I feel like I'm in love with that joy. You, you want to pity who? I should be the one to pity you. Because if you dare go in there and say a word, I will never buy you ice cream or biscuits again. And you know you can't do without any of those. Look at you. My daughter. It is God that gives children. So don't ever think too much of it. God's time, they say, is always the best. Mm. So whenever it is time, you will have as many children as you wish to have. Amen. Okay? Yes. So, take care of yourself. Oh, but what did I ever do to deserve a mother-in-law like you? You are an awesome daughter to me. I love you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate your love. Thank Mom, you. you have a flight to catch. If I catch this boy. Yeah. Let's go and meet them. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Please give me this your hand. Give me what? Give you what? Oh, my yeah. hey, please have a safe trip back, okay? Thank you, my daughter. You're welcome. You've heard what I told you. I heard you. Hey, but why were you disturbing my discussion with my daughter? Sorry, ma'am. You can't. <laughs> Look at you. I, get love you. I love you too. <laughs> really? Take care of yourself, okay? <laughs> bye. We'll miss you. I miss you too. <laughs> bye bye. And my dog. Yes. I'm gonna see you soon, okay? Okay. Mwah. Mwah. See you. <laughs> Alright. Take care. Yes, sure. Drive safe. She said bye. Where are you going? I'm going with them because I watch another one. Did you hear her? She says she's following you people so that you can give her another hug. It's okay, she can join us.
Teresa. Welcome. How are you? Do you buy the biscuit? Oh, here you go again. No biscuits for now. Please. Is my wife back? No. She's not. Please do now. I said no biscuits. Welcome, sir. Thank you. How okay, are you? Sir. I'm fine, sir. That's good. Go chill out with your friend. <laughs> come, come, come. Yeah. What? Can you stop staring? Was I? No, you weren't. Listen, the earlier you stop looking at him, the better for you because you're never going to have him. What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. You better don't. Please, I want to use myself. Cheap girl, all of a sudden you want to eat yourself. Are you my bladder? Please, oh, I want please to go to my room and eat yourself. something. Is it that you naturally have self-control? How do you mean? Your brother-in-law. That man is so fine. I mean, see his beard, his chest, his Angela. Can you stop? That is my brother-in-law married to my sister. And so? Wait, you're trying to tell me that you are not attracted to him in any way. That's you sure blood is running through your veins. This girl, you have officially gone crazy. You are mad. You don't even know. Anyway, I feel that is the reason God did not give me any fine windows. You know, I told you my brother in laws are very ugly. Ordinarily, I've been misbehaving. Stop admiring somebody's husband. It is a sin. Do not admire someone else's property. What is your problem? Listen, Angela, after today, I do not want to see you around me. Do not come to my house again, please. Just like that. Just like that. Because I said your brother-in-law is fine. Do not repeat it. See, come and start going. It's enough. Let's go, Aya. Yeah? Wait, wait. Come and go. You think I'm an orphan? I don't have a place to stay. I come here because I like you. Oh, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Don't scatter it because I'm winning you now. You have scattered it. What is your problem? Uh -uh. How can you be lost in over somebody's property? property. Are you insane? Property, huh? His mate used to marry too. What see, is, what's see, the tell you. I think this is where we say goodbye. You will stop coming to my house after today, please.
afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Ah, you live in this neighborhood? No, I came to see one of my friends. Oh, oh, okay. So you have other friends in this neighborhood aside um, Lisa? Something like that, sir. Mm, I can see. So where are you heading to? I'm going home, but my keke guy hasn't come yet. Oh, sorry about that. Thank you, sir. Hop in, let me drop you. Ah, thank you, sir. How are you, sir? I'm all right. Have, have you eaten anything? Are you hungry? Um, don't worry about that. My wife must have prepared lunch for me. Oh, okay, sir. Um, sir, do you like banga rice? I make you very well. <laughs> I'm not a fan of banga. Okay, tell me, what is your favorite food? Yes, sure. I can make it. <laughs> well, um... <clears throat> My favorite is um, porridge. Ah, I make porridge jam very well. I, I put different kind of fishes inside. You would love it. Maybe you give me your address for your office so I'll bring it for you. No, no. <laughs> Don't worry about that. My wife prepares porridge very well. As a matter of fact, I don't think anyone else can beat my wife when it comes to porridge. <laughs> um, so where are you going to stop? Um, That side up. I don't know what is reacting on my body like this so. I don't know. Just everywhere in my body. So see, you feel it no, now? No, yeah. I think you should see your doctor. Um, okay. Go see your doctor. Okay, sir. Where did you say you're stopping um, again? Still forward a bit. I don't okay. know why this is suffocating me. Uh. Um, yeah. sir, please, I'm looking for a job, oh. in case there's any vacancy, you could. Um, for now, there is none, but if there is any, your friend will reach out to you. Okay, sir. Um. Guess you're stopping here. Yes, sir. Here, here's my number, sir. What for? Um, you can call me whenever you're bored and you want to hang out. I'm, I'm a very good company. <laughs> Please use the door. Sir, did I offend you? I don't need your number. I use the door. Okay. You can still keep it in case the vacancy comes out. You just call me, sir. God bless you, sir. Thank use the door and take your number. Sir, this is not the... Take... A piece of paper sir, out of my car. Please, uh, my house I is don't still forward. have time. Go down. <laughs> sir, please, I'm sorry. What's wrong with girls of nowadays? What's wrong with them? Can you imagine giving me your number? Don't get it. So disrespectful. That's quite funny. <laughs> See, what is this? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. I appreciate it. Yeah, um, this other part here.
Hello? Are you still at home? Yes, I'm just about to leave. How about Phil? Has he gone to his office? No, he's upstairs. Good. Please go upstairs and tell him that I need him to help me bring the file that is on the table. It is written confidential. I need it. Please go now. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Here you are. You did add something. My sister said that you should check on the table for a file with confidential written in it. She asked that you get it across to her office when you go to the shop. It's okay. I will get it. How do you mean? Your brother in law. The man is so fine. I mean, see his beard, yeah, his, yeah, his chest, his Angela. Can you stop? That is my brother in law, married to my sister. And so, wait, you're trying to tell me that you are not attracted to him in any way. Are you sure blood is running through your brain? This do. is a blonde and um, dark brown mixture of red, kind of. And right? a touch of gray. Oh, wow. Yeah. This was the same kind of hair you wore the first day I set my eyes on you. Mm -hmm. No kidding. You remember that? I do. Oh. <laughs> okay, what else do you remember? Wait, uh, hold on. Baby girl, you can change the channel now. We're not watching anymore. What else? What was I wearing? I mean, blow my mind. If you remember this, I'll be, I'll be blown out of my mind. Um, I think um, a white top. And? A pink uh, oh. skin piece. Did you hear me? <laughs> Lisa, we're not watching again. We're conversing now. Lisa? Yes, yes, yeah. What Are did you, you say? Are you okay? Uh, yeah, sure. You sure? Mm. Okay, um, go ahead and watch whatever. Well, oh, we're good okay. here. 
Did you say white and pink? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no friggin' way! Ah, my bad. But you have the uh, top spaghetti <laughs> top. <laughs> I know, white spaghetti. on it, white macaroni. 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 There you go. Mm -hmm. Let me put her there, serve it in my hand to make it a smooth journey from your plate to your mouth. Always making me feel like the king that I am. Yes, you are. There you go. Mm. Okay, finish one, your mind makes me small. <laughs> you always make me feel like the king that I am. You are, Ken. Where are you going? I'm done. But you haven't even touched your phone. I'm okay. She's watching her weight, I guess. <laughs> Young girls of nowadays. It costs some starvation to maintain that figure. <laughs> mm hmm. Not in a lot. Do you want that Beyonce's video where the models used to swallow cotton? Mm -hmm. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. It's alright. What's this? You know you can confide in me. What's going on? I think I want to get, get the police outside school. Eh? Yes. I want to be by myself. Like, I want to leave outside this house. But you... You enjoy staying with us. What has changed? You and your husband need privacy. That's all I'm giving. Lisa? I said it, you have not been your usual self. You no longer spend time with us. You keep to yourself a lot. It's strange. Now you want to move out of this house. Have we offended you in any way? No. Then what is it? I'm okay. Lisa, look at me. Tell me what it is and we'll fix it. If it's something we're doing wrong or should be doing, tell me about it. We'll put it in place. You're my only sister and you're all I've got. We have been there for each other since our parents died and the thought of you leaving is going to shatter me. I'm going to spend the rest of my days worrying about you if you leave where I can see you. Angela, I'm in big trouble. I'm in big trouble. I swear, I wish I can just unsee everything that I saw that day. I have not been myself. I've just been having this wild imagination running through my mind. Is there a way I can just shake off this ugly image of my head? Because it's drowning me and I don't like this feeling. I'm so scared. I don't even know what to do. What can I do? Unfortunately, nothing. Just move on. Move on. Mm -hmm. It's not possible, you know. I mean, this is my sister's husband, my in-law, like my brother-in-law. That makes it easy. He's not your blood brother. See, it's a natural thing to happen when you've seen something like this. Besides, this young man is so fine. Stop it. You cannot even keep goats and yam and expect it not to eat it. The seed has already been sown. For you to have peace, do the needful. It's not biggie, really. I can't. 
No, I can't. Let me tell you. Hmm? You know, when I tell you these things without giving you an example, you feel I'm telling you something that has never happened. Mine was my stepdad. I saw him stuck naked, like nothing. He kept tormenting me. I kept seeing the images until I confronted him. You did what? Wait, Angela. Hmm? Don't tell... Oh my God. Yes. I did not live in together. My mom, my dad, Jesus. I did not together. Leave all these things you do. You act like a child, seriously. And let me tell you something. After that incident, every likeness I had for him turned to hate. So you better make up your mind. Immediately you satisfy this sexual urge. You will feel better. It's either you like him the more or you start hating him. So choose your fate. It's nothing serious. Ah. Sex that people used to do, Kola. It's something you're feeling. Go and do it and help yourself. If not, this picture, I'm telling you. Oh, please, can you get me water to drink? I'm going to use it whole lot. You mean? You're looking all giddy today. I'm just being my usual self. Nah. You haven't been yourself for the past few days. Or could it be your monthly visit or Stop, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is the Lisa we all know, not that grumpy girl. <laughs> what if I told you you cost my grumpiness? Me? How? <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> hey. Uh, Lisa. Um, please, can you give me some body lotion? My own has finished. It's all right. See, it's over there. You can get it for me now. You can get it yourself. I'm dressing up. Why don't you take it to your room? When you're done, you can bring it back. Oh, no, I don't want the stress of going there and coming back again. You and soft life. Mm -hmm. Don't you like soft life? Yes, yeah, your room is stress. Yes, no. It's all right then. Now, uh, by the time you're done, um, when you're done, you can return it back okay. where you pick it up from. Okay. I'll be downstairs. Okay. 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 So you take care. <laughs> So. 
Josh will get five zero. Mm. Mm. Me, of course, I'm trashing her as usual. It's me. Wow. Ten mil. Can you five. imagine? Till I, it's five. Till it's five. I hope there's food in this house because I am famished. Yes, there's food. There's food. Charlie, it's microwave for me. Okay, that's microwave. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you wearing? Did you change your wardrobe? No, she said, I didn't. You don't like it. Okay. As long as you don't wear it outside. No, I'm not mad. <laughs> no, since I won't wear it outside. Thank you. Okay. So, Baby, I'll be traveling to Abuja this weekend for a meeting. What meeting? It's for all bank managers. Oh, okay. You want me to come with you? <laughs> that would have been nice. But I'll be too busy even for you. Uh... But not to worry. I'll be gone for just two days. <sighs> you know, two days is like two months. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna miss you. I miss you too. It's okay. I understand. It's alright. So. <laughs> For just two days. Two don't, days cry. Don't, cry, don't cry. Don't cry. I'll be back before you know it. Okay? Okay. Where you dash one more? Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Here and now? Uh, yes. <laughs> I can make you a transfer. Hey. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'll do it when I'm settled. Thank you, sis. By the way, I'm going to take care of my house. I beg. You know, now this man, that's not so. I know it's my house, but like, I can't. Have you forgotten the man you? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he actually got the code. <laughs> Sister's code. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> I got it. I trust you. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Bye, sis. Bye, girl. Love I'll you. call you when I land. Yeah, sure. Love you. Don't forget to do the
I wasn't invited. Because this drink is not meant for someone like you. Really? Mm -hmm. Who said that? You are. 24. 24, not 14. Besides, I do this with my boyfriend. You have a boyfriend? Of course I do. And your sister and I haven't met him? In due time. Am I going to get the drink now? Should I grab it and run to my room? <laughs> get a glass. Okay. <laughs> For real, <laughs> just like that. Yeah, just like that. We could play a game, you know. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh, no games. One more, and that is that. Yeah, that is that. Hmm? Because my heart. Okay. <sighs> you amaze me. Hey! <laughs> 
Lisa. I am so sorry about what happened last night. It's not your fault. I started it all. Lisa, you were drunk. I should have known better. I should have protected you. But I didn't. You were tipsy too. So let's just bring it to my call. Lisa, I have wronged you and my wife. How do I even face her? How do I face my wife? Don't you understand? Can we please not embark on this cute tree? The deed has been done, so let's just move on, please. Lisa, you call me big bro. Big brothers are supposed to protect their kids' sisters and not to take advantage of them. Don't you get it? Don't you get it? You did not take advantage of me. And you're not entirely my brother. Listen, we've made this grave mistake. And we're never going to do it again. So why don't you just drop it here and... Don't let my sister ever get to hear about this because you know she would not survive it. Please. Back now. Welcome. Sis. How have you been? Very well, thank you. Did you cook? Yeah, sure. I because I'm rice. famished. Mm -hmm. There's rice. And what? Uh, what small else? Small thing. <laughs> what else? Rice. Small, small thing. What's wrong? You're not eating your food. Um, I'm just um, having a slight headache, like a migraine, something. Really? I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, that explains why you've been unusually quiet all through the ride from the airport. Yeah, it, exactly. You're very observant. Oh, I just uh, feel I need to take a nap. Well, you feel better when you wake up. Yeah, hopefully. But at least eat some food. You need food in your belly. Okay. Even the chicken, at least. It's really tasty. Try it. Oh, sorry, big bro. I think it's um, stress. Right? Yeah. Mm. You know what stress does? It wears you out. <laughs> so how many hours did you take to make this? 
Just two seconds. <laughs> What are you trying to do? What is the meaning of that? Are you serious? Do you want to sell us out? You don't expect me to pretend like everything is normal when it's not. Oh. Okay. Why don't you just walk in there and tell her, okay, we did this and we did that. So you can be at peace. Listen, she's my sister too. And I feel the same guilt that you feel. But please, it will do us more good if you pretend that like nothing happened. <laughs> you see you. Uh, huh? Every time, ice cream, ice cream. What it's is not this? fair. Why would you promise me ice cream and you will not want to get it? Ice cream? Mm -hmm. Cold stone ice yeah, cream. Yeah, cold stone. Mm -hmm. <sighs> hey, brother. You have to get her cold stone ice cream. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, you see how your dreams tonight. Oh. <laughs> on whose side are you on? I'm on the side of my baby. <laughs> In that case, you are on my side. <laughs> but I'm also your baby. Mm. Hey, God, the baby. pressure. Baby. Wala, wala, wala. You won't escape this Not question. Not you, now go set off. Please. Baby, please tell me which baby are you supporting? Uh, there's something that needs to be inside. Come on inside. Come on inside. Come on inside. Come on inside. You have to buy it. Come on inside. You have to buy it. Wait, 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 Lisa. Are you trying to tell me you finally did it with him? Hey! Men! You see why I keep saying, fear men? So after the, all I am principled the young man, he went as low as sleeping with his sister-in-law. What a shame. You see why I hate hypocrites? This is my problem with them. Angela, are we still on the same topic? Mm -hmm. Don't ask me that. The question now is, how do you feel? Like, give me gist. I feel dirty. I feel like a witch. Mm -hmm. I feel guilty. I've just betrayed my elder sister. That should not be your problem. Now that you have satisfied your urge, if this kind of scenario plays out again, would you still want to do it? Never. God forbid, I don't feel anything again. Good, you are free now. Because when there will be a problem is if you still feel this sexual urge for him. But since you've conquered, congratulations. So how was it? What did you feel to me? You a foolish person. Why are you shouting on me? Were you blind when you went to sleep with your sister's husband? After all day, my sister's husband is a decent young man. It's this one, it's that one. My dear, please, you should be feeling guilty, not you. After all, you, um, I've seen two sisters marry one man. Lisa? 
Why are you crouching onto your tummy? What's the matter? Lisa. What's, what's going on? Talk to me. Is this something you ate? Lisa? Oh my god. Phil! <sighs> Baby! <sighs> Baby, please come! Come, come. Try, try and rise. Try, try. Oh. Darling! Why would you do such a thing? Why? Why would you play with your life like that? This pregnancy can be kept. <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> it is dangerous for you to continue to attempt to terminate this pregnancy. Doing so almost cost you your life, as you can see. Doesn't the fetus know that I don't want it? I don't want it. Well, isn't it pretty obvious that this particular fetus wants to be kept? Can't be kept. Can't be kept. I don't want to keep it. <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> for the sake of your life, desist from trying to abort this pregnancy. Stop it. And this brings me to the almighty question. Who's responsible? <laughs> Lisa. Who is responsible for this pregnancy? Tell you he's responsible. No. Okay. I'm afraid she might do something crazy. Isn't life funny? For years we have yearned for a child. And there she is, pregnant and determined to terminate the pregnancy, even at the detriment of her own life. So you want her to keep it? She doesn't have a choice now. She already tried to abort it and it failed. It almost cost her her life, matter of fact. And the doctor has warned sternly, saying that another attempt might cost her her life. She just has to keep it. Maybe. I know she respects you a lot and she listens to you. Can you please convince her to keep the baby? Please? It's okay. I will talk to her. Hopefully she will listen. Okay. Hopefully. Everything's going to be all right. Yeah. 
Why on earth are you even thinking of getting rid of the baby? Are you okay? And how do you expect me to have a baby for my brother-in-law? Your sister doesn't have a child yet for him. This might be his only chance to fatherhood. Have you thought about the emotional damage that this will cause my sister? Have you thought about the betrayal? That's not the problem. The good thing is you're going to help sustain your sister's marriage. Have you thought about that? this be becoming an outsider's case? They will take your sister's place. Listen, Zin has been father and mother to me since our parents passed on. How do you expect me to walk up to her with this sad news? It's not sad news. You are doing her a favor. Keep her marriage. What if it was an outsider? They will just come and take your sister's position. You should be grateful. Lisa! Lisa! We need to talk. If it's about this pregnancy, I suggest you don't talk about it. That's not the point. Lisa, I need to know who is responsible for this pregnancy. Are you serious? Like, are you seriously asking me that question? Okay, who do you think is responsible if it is not you? You told me you had a boyfriend. I broke up long before that night. How do you mean? Listen, don't worry. My sister doesn't have to know about it. I'll fix it. Okay. So what are you going to do about this pregnancy? Do you want to keep it? I do not have much of a choice. Listen, Lisa. I know how you feel. Your sister, my beloved wife, I love her so much. I know I have always wanted a child, but not like this. Listen, your sister can never know I am responsible for this pregnancy. What? Do you understand? Hey. Ah, sister. Uh, I'm just... I know, please. Baby, please open the door, please. It's not what you think. It's not what you think, please. Just open the door. Let's talk. My love. Zen? Open the door, it's not what you think, okay? I, just, just open the door, okay? Face to face, I'm gonna explain the whole thing to you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Babe? Babe? Please, my love, open the door, please, please. I beg you, just open the door, okay? Okay, uh -huh. Just for two minutes, and, and, and then I walk away, please. Just open the door. Oh, God. Where could she have gone to? Baby, please pick up the phone. Pick up the phone, baby, please. I don't want you to do something stupid. What have we done? I don't think your sister will ever forgive me. Why are you making this whole thing about yourself? How about me? But you cost it all! Yes. Are you serious? Are you blaming me for something we both did? Did I get myself pregnant? Don't even go there. Don't even go there. Yes. Yes. What? There's only 
you one place in this wish? Ah! My mom! Your mom. Ah, ah, ah. What is it? Who's calling? My mom, my mom. Pick it! Quiet, pick it! Pick it! Pick the call! Okay, okay, okay. Uh, hello, mom. Mom, 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 I, I, I. What did she say? She, she, she's coming here to. Hey! How could you descend so low, Phil? Philip, how can you do this? Hey! How can you do this to your sister? Lily? Oh my god! The degree of this shame is very unfathomable. This is useless of you people. I got one car outside. Eh? See, let me tell you. Whatever decision she takes, I will solidly stand by her. Yes! How could you do such a thing to someone who has virtually given up her life for your sake? Can you want to make it? Eh? If you love drug in Anya, Phil! If you love drug in Anya, how can you rub this shame on me? How can you do that? Eh? Not having respect for your mother. Can I get you see Kolu? This is a disgrace. And you, Lisa, I'm so ashamed of you. I'm so ashamed of you. Eh? You can't even control yourself. Even if he did not control himself, you can't control yourself! Eh? I don't want. I don't want to worry about near for. That's what you are. That's what you are. Gwensu. You have to carry this pregnancy and give birth to that child. It's as simple as ABC. Nonsense. Lisa, Lisa, hurry up. We don't want to be late. I'm coming. Okay. Hey. Hello, love. Hello. How are you? Mm -hmm. You're dressed. Yes, I forgot to tell you. I'm taking Lisa to the hospital for her antenatal service. Oh, okay. Yes. That would be nice. Lisa, come on, let's go. We'll be back soon. All right. Drive safe, okay? Yes, I will. Come on. I cannot just wait to give birth to this child. I mean, my life has just turned in a couple of months. So you want to tell me that up to now, he hasn't bought you a car? A car? What would I be needing a car for? Like, they take me to school every day. Are you a child? I don't know how to drive. Then he will get you a driver. I can't. Hi, baby. I have to. I have your shadow. Wait, I'm going to say, you Bro, she's on the other side, close Where? to the car. That side. Where? That side. There. Yes. Okay, I have to use my glasses. No, no, I'm telling you, there. No, don't look here. This is the wrong place. There. I'm getting fragrance from this side, not from this side. Uh-uh. There she is! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you have it! Come! Oh <laughs> did it, wait, wait. I don't trust you. Did you tell him where no, I was? No, she didn't. I, I was telling him to go that way. She said you were there, but 
I am so blessed with the kind of sister that God gave me. I mean, see how happy she looks and the way she handled this issue. I'm proud of her. I am honestly very, very blessed. Ready or not, here I am. What do you mean? It's you who is pregnant. Oh, I, I, I think it went that way. That way, yeah. Auntie, it is you who is pregnant. And I guess she's the one getting the blood and the pressure. Ah! Is that correct? Right? How did you know? I found you! That's my sister. I'm talking about. Sorry, oh my goodness. I'm just getting the over. That's nice. That was it, my sense. progress. Someone yeah. told you. So I think I should be massaging sure. your feet. Is there any wrong wow. with it? Six year old. Well, <laughs> my right turn. Now. Are you tired? Pregnant, and yet she's the one getting all the love and attention. Ah! Is that true? How did you know? I found you! That's my sister I'm talking about. Sorry, oh, my goodness. No, you, you I'm just getting the over. That was my progress. Medicine. You know, I always wanted to ask why you are not taking your exercise routine seriously like the doctor has advised you to take it. Okay. As I was saying, Lisa. You need to take your exercise routine seriously, just like the doctor has prescribed. Because exercising is not only for the able-bodied, it's beneficial even for pregnant women. But why does this even bother you? I would not want you to have complications during childbirth. <laughs> That's one of it. What one of the things that could happen if you don't take your exercise seriously? Can I ask you a question? Why did you allow me stay back even after we both know that you're offended? Why are we having this conversation? We need to have this conversation. You see, it just dawned on me that you want me to sit here and be a baby-making machine for you because you know that you can't give your husband any child. What are you saying to me? The truth. The truth? You see, I am the one who is pregnant, yet I sleep alone to deal with this uncomfortable nuisance that comes with pregnancy. And you, 
you run to your husband and then you sleep and you forget that you have a baby sister who you have to look out for. Lisa, why are you saying these things to me? Oh. Lisa? behind I'll massage it for you. Eh? No. Me, I want the father of my child to, to do the massage. You are joking, right? Joke. I'm not joking. Did I get myself pregnant? Ah, I did not get myself pregnant, so I will not be the only person suffering from pregnancy. So what do you want me to do? I want you to do what an expectant father does. Uh -huh. You will massage my back. And henceforth, I will no longer sleep alone. Instead, you come to my room to sleep, or I come here and sleep. I will not sleep alone. Uh, what? You must be out of your mind. <laughs> out of my mind? Okay, in actual sense, am I not the one who is supposed to lie down on this bed? I'm the one carrying your child, not sister that does not have a room to carry your child. What? Listen. What did you just say? I'm sorry, but I had to just tell you. Somebody needs to tell me. And it's just to know the truth. Lisa. Please, let me lie like down. Don't talk to me! I don't want to listen to you! I'm genuinely sorry, please. You're sorry about what? What else do you want to say? That you had complication as a result of an abortion that you decisively embarked on. And now you can't bear children. It is unfathomable that you could keep such it's sensitive information from me, your husband. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, honey. I was going to tell you, I swear. But I, I was afraid. I was afraid I would lose you if I dared say it. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry, please. Please, please, please. please. I was here. Driving myself to not. Thinking, I am important. I'm sorry. I was here driving myself to not thinking I am important, not knowing you have been the curse, you have been the issue why you can't bear a child. And you think, you think everything will just go back to normal? No, things are not done that way for you to keep such, such a sensitive, such a vital information from your husband. What else, what else you cannot do? What else are you not capable of doing? Tell me. Please, please, babe. My life, I swear, I am, I am sorry. I apologize for this when it plays in your heart to forgive me. Don't ever call me honey. Don't ever call me baby. I don't want to hear any bad words out from your mouth because you have lost the right to do so. Do you understand? I hate you, I hate you. Please. Please, I'm sorry. I really am, I'm sorry. Philip. 
Philip. I can hear you, Mom. I want you to forgive your wife. She's truly sorry. I want you to take her back. I've had you, Mom. I never said I was going to end my marriage. But we all know things may never remain the same. Why? I ask you, why would things change? She's your wife. And remember, it's not every woman that found herself in that kind of situation that would be proud to say it out. And also remember you hurt her. And she forgave you. So be a man and take your wife back. Build your relationship. It's God that gives children. Children will come. Or oh, don't you have faith? You know I'm pregnant. You want to hurt me? nauseous and weak and I've been drawing up let me go back Once again, congratulations. Sorry. 
You can do it. Take it. Just breathe. Oh. Sorry, sorry. Oh. Sorry, sorry. You can do it. You can do it. Oh. Sorry, sorry. I baby's alive. That should make you happy. Alive? Yes. I should be happy. For a sick child. A child born with sickle cell. Is that what you call alive? <laughs> At least the baby has a chance to live. To live a life of misery. A life filled with pain and crisis. Why did I have to go through this kind of pain just to birth a sick child? Why did I have to go through this pain to give birth to a child that has sickle cell? Why, God, why did God not just take that child away from me? Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Baby, please, we need to talk. What is it? You are pregnant. I... I thought to you... That I was hopeless? Well, thank God. Thank God... God is not mad. I am not going there. <laughs> Done with what exactly? Done with the baby, the stress, the late night sleep, everything I am done. Hmm? Yes, I am done because I did not beg God to bless me with a curse. <sighs> did I hear you right? Yes, sir. Huh. Did you just refer to your own child as a curse? <laughs> Lisa. Just look at me. Look how dusty I look. Because of a gift that has refused to be kept. I cannot do this all. Please. They should guide that baby, whatever they want to, when they are tired, anywhere they want. I don't care. I don't care. 
I don't care. Ah. You need to shut up and be quiet. I agree that you're stressed. But what your baby needs is proper love and care. Mm. Proper love and care. Like the late night sleep, all those sleepless nights is not enough love, eh? It's not enough. I have to kill myself for the baby to know that I, I am rendering enough love. Me, I don't want to. Whatever they want to do, that baby should do. Yes, hello? Yes? What? Lisa, Lisa. What are you doing here? I don't understand. I beg, give me water to get back here. What are you doing here? Where are you going to? My friend, will you get out of this place right now? Lisa, what has gotten into you? What you have done? You know, I was actually waiting to see you here so I can tell you that you were the mean-spirited daughter of the sea. I was looking at you right now. I do not even have anything to say to you because you're already useless. Now will you get out of this house? Lisa. Yes, you sold a bad seed in me. You almost broke this home. But now I am wiser and I do not want you around me. So get out. You should say you never mind. Are you okay? Now me sleep with your brother-in-law. Now me get belay for your brother-in-law. You had your choice to make. And you made a very useless one because you were a cheap allotting prostitute. Hey! Did the Chris? Okay! What's going on here? What's going on here? What is it? Who are you? Who are you? Madam, don't let me change that for you. Can you get out from this place? Get out! Get out from this place! Get out! Get out! My papa. Go read first somewhere. You go see what in David do Goliath. Stupid, stupid people. Who is she? It's okay. Stop calling. <laughs> she said, I look malnourished. It's okay. It's okay. Everything will be fine. Stop crying. It will get better with time. Okay? Stop crying. Now, you don't have to go. Of what use is it for me to stay here now? My baby is dead. I broke the sister's code. I shouldn't have betrayed you. You're a beautiful soul. I just have to go, please. I want you to know that no matter what happens, you'll remain my sister for life. I forgive you, and I'll always be here rooting for you. I love you, and I'll always check up on you, okay? Thank you. It's okay. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. I have to go now. Thank you so much. My love. 
I am vehemently sorry about all that has happened. I take the blame. I know I have really hurt you. I am so ashamed of myself. Please, please find a place in your heart to forgive me. Give us another chance to, to make this marriage, this, our love story work. Please, please, I beg you, please. Please, I beg you. My daughter. There is this saying that to err is human and to forgive is divine. You have endured until now. You have fought this battle and you have won. Please, for my sake, Forgive my son. Please, I beg of you. Please, my daughter. Forgive him. I forgive you. Oh. Stand up. Sorry. I'm sorry to have kept a secret that almost ruined us. Forgive me. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I love you. I love you too. Thank you, my daughter. You're welcome, Mom. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah. What is it? Shopping. The baby. The baby. Sorry, 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 my Easy. Daughter. I think the baby's coming. Yes. Thank you, Easy. Ooh. Mom, let's go to the hospital. To the hospital. Oh. To what? Hospital. Why? Take it easy. Wait. Mom, 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 mom. Do you feel where's the khaki? Let me get it. Let me get it. Get it. Oh, it's it's painful. Oh, okay. I have, I have it. Let's go. Let's go. Hello? Hey, John. Oh, one name. So sorry. I couldn't come back again today. Something very fortunate happened. Yes, my daughter-in-law went into labor. And as we speak, she has given birth to twins. As I'm talking to you now, I am a proud grandmother. Of twins. I got that gun walking and why? I'm going to be here to wear you. And when the mom found the guy in the body came out. Thank God. Thank God. Hi. I am so happy. Yeah? I'm even going to the hospital now to give them some diapers and the baby clothes. And when I come, let me rush. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hey! Yo, my man, I need your man. 
Yoma Melani, Yoma, Oma Mula, Wani, Nafi, Meka, Oma Tarani, Kaito, Boroko, Oma Nyangwa. Hey!